this is Jeanette Mason. I work with uh, her at Stop and Shop during the winter. She's been there for a number of years. And she's been out fishing with me a few times. And she's gonna help me in the design of a set of rods I wanna build this winter using 17 pound test lead core. This first rod we hooked up on has a lot of action in the tip and a fairly heavy butt. That's one type of action that I want to try out. And the fish that we're getting here is a decent size. It's about 30 inches or so, a 30 inch striper. Here's Jeanette with another fish on. And this rod is more parabolic in its bend. It doesn't quite have all the action in the tip. It, you know, the action plays out through the entire, entire rod. This particular fish wasn't as big as the first one, but it still gave Jeanette and myself an idea of the action of this particular rod design. We hooked up again on a rod that has that real flexible uh, tip and a lot of muscle in the butt. Uh, this seemed to be a little bit bigger fish than the second one we caught, but unfortunately it got off close to the boat, so we, we didn't get it in. But uh, it still gave myself and Jeanette an idea of the action of this particular rod. I didn't want to go home with just one fish. So we went over towards Brewster and put out the jigging rod. And it didn't take long for Jeanette to hook up on that one. I built these rods too a few years ago and uh, they give you a nice action. And this fish was pretty good size. It was about 34 inches or so. So we both got dinner. Jeanette's been out with me a few times. She's a, a small young lady. She's just a little under five foot, but I tell you, she is a great fisher person, a great angler, and, and she loves to fish, and I love having her on the boat. She's a real good person, and she's gonna help me decide how to build these two rods this coming winter.